Alrighty guys, welcome back to Star Wars Review. Today I am reviewing the Higher Republic Adventures Issue 10, Back Together in a Way 3, which was written by Daniel Jose Older with art by Tony Bruno, and was released on November 17th, 2021. So yeah, I thought it was a fine issue. Um, it was a lot more action heavy and fast paced than I was kind of expecting. Uh, and it was once again mainly focusing on a uh, corp, uh, which we see more flashbacks of, uh, you know, his when he was uh, younger on Takadana, which is time uh, Yoda is coming to take him away. Uh, but before Yoda, he, before you know, before he goes with Yoda, uh, Sov talks to him about, you know, telling him it's fine to wear his skull, uh, you know, until he's ready to take it off. Uh, which in the present day, um, after the Jedi Temple on Takadana was blown up in the last issue, uh, we see him without his skull, because it got broken in the explosion, um, but, you know, he remembers back to, uh, what Soft told him when he was younger, and at this moment, he believes that he is ready to no longer wear it, and so with the Nile ships, uh, coming to attack them, he goes up and takes them all out himself, jumping from one ship to the other, while, uh, Maz and Sov watch on the ground, um, which in them, when they kind of see them talk to each other, you know, about the temple exploding and whatnot, and Sav asks, uh, Maz to, uh, if she can, uh, stay at the town, at, um, the castle for a little bit. Well, you know, it was a little funny moment, but, um, you know, eventually, um, Court takes out all the Nile there, and returns to the ground and meets up with the other Padawans, who are surprised to see his real face for the first time, uh, but they still embrace him, even though he's a little different now, um, but uh, the issue ends with uh, one um, Nile uh, sister, the one um, s sister Nile member, the Krill sisters, I think they're called, I didn't write it down, uh, who blew up the temple, uh, reporting back to uh, Crix, which uh, she tells him what she did, which Crix is uh, impressed by it, so I guess he kind of offers her to be his um, second in command, I guess, uh, and that's, but, you know, that's where the issue ends. So yeah, like I said, I thought it was fine, uh, like the previous issue was very focused on Court, which, you know, I, I definitely enjoyed that. Definitely progressed his character uh, forward. But the um, Nile attack on Takadana kind of got wrapped up quickly. You know, I wish there was a little more to it. Um, and because I, I wanted to see more Maz uh, also, but, you know, it is what it is. Uh, and, you know, I, I also was kind of hoping for some more Cricks in this issue. Uh, because he really hasn't been super present in the last... Uh, you know, five issues. Um, the first issue of uh, this arc, he kind of was, but you know, other than that, he really hasn't been super present. So I was hoping for a little more of him, but once again, it is what it is. Um, so yeah. Anyways, um, my grade for the issue, I'm gonna give it a B minus. So yeah. Anyways, uh, next um, hyperbolic review should be the final issue of the Monster of Temple Peak. Uh. Higher Public Adventures miniseries, so you can check that out then. But in the meantime, you can check out all my other Higher Public stuff and everything else I do. But I've been stars, so you know, I'll catch you guys in the uh, next one.